guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Pink Lady. Today is a special, special, um, vlog. Because I'm excited that this one shirt that I've been waiting on for almost a week now. So, well, actually I got it Monday, but now I'm excited because I can do the video now. So, whatever. But anyways, my friend, Celebrate Life Production, is selling merch and I finally got my merch and here's the shirt guys I love it it's so complete and plus it, for one they don't come with this this is my own shirt but it's a t-shirt and it's like the women's size and it fits really really nice and I mean if I could put something underneath it like this and it still feels like I don't feel like I'm suffocating or anything but I think it looks awesome it's really really cool and I'm going to sit here and support my friend but so but if you want to go on his channel and he is selling merch so um yeah so I'm excited for him that his, and then finally I finally got the shirt <laughs> but yeah I'm, prom I'm like promoting on my own channel for somebody else I, I don't care As if you're, you're worth it on my my perspective I will support you in any way possible so I'm a big supporter for other people and stuff like that. I hope it gets in return to be supportive, but I don't sit there and be a person that will, like, go, you know, to other channels and try to be self-promoting. I don't. I just want to go there for, for one, friendship, because sometimes you can get friendship out of this. And two, it's just like, if I like your content, I will come back to your channel. I mean, if you have content where I'm just like, I don't know, and I don't know if I want to support you or not. But, you know, if it catches my eye or that I try to because I'm like, I'm a very friendly person. So, I mean, I like to make a lot of friends. I guess that's just my personality, I guess. But since I put on this shirt, I've been looking at this. When I put on the shirt this morning, I just sat there and looked at it. I, um, it kind of hit me a little bit because I'm still, I'm still not to my fullest of what I really should be in my own my own way I have issues with myself I don't I mean I've gotten better since like like from when I you know way back when I was younger I've gotten better now of accepting myself but I'm still not fully accepting myself I still have um, body issues with myself I still feel like you know I still try to sit there and be like I go on these random diet sometimes like I will start you know doing these diets and and it harms me and then and it takes like you know some friends of mine to um to um tell me that you know this is not right and they could tell by the attitude I have and stuff because I do get kind of <laughs> irritated and stuff like that if I go through stuff there's been times where I've gone to periods of times where I haven't ate a few like only like maybe something very very small like just a snack and I can make it through the day because I've like trained my body to not feel hungry and I have seen myself do that and it really I, I had to self reflect on myself and and then my friends have seen it too the ones you know that actually you know live around here that I have have seen my attitude and how it's changed and stuff and they they asked me what's going on and I had to break down to one of my friends about it but I'm still not fully there like I still see myself as you know I have a lot of fat and everything you know I feel fat basically I guess how you want to say it I don't feel like you know I don't know it's just like but I've gotten a lot better with myself. I've been accepting myself a lot better. So, I mean, that has helped me. And then also, what, um, but me and my friends, Jukebox Inc. and Celebrate Life and stuff. And especially, you know, with some of the messages they've had and have gone through or whatever they've gone through. I've kind of gotten like, okay, I'm not like the only one feeling to a certain point of their life of like what's going on and I do appreciate that and I in the community they both have is so awesome and I do appreciate being 
in their community and being part of the community and you know and they're genuine people I really do appreciate them and their friendship and then also other people that come to the channel and like <laughs> other mods that I'm friends with on their channel you know I feel a good sense of friendship and commodity in that and I really do appreciate it but you guys have and I just want to let them know that you guys haven't seen the true self of me I kind of do hide a lot of things you wouldn't think that I'm like, you know, with certain things I do and everything, you don't see it. I kind of keep a good act about it because I, my self-esteem got very low as, because, I don't know if I want to put this out there, but I've had somebody in my life that's been personal that have actually brought me down on my, my weight and everything like that and, um, Sorry guys, I'm going to break down. And it really made my self-worth go way down and my self-esteem very, very low. And so I have a hard time. Like, especially with, like, uh, males in general. Because, like, you know, for, like, dating purposes, I have an issue with that. Because I feel like anything I'm, like, if I get close to somebody or anything like that, I feel like they're judging me on my weight. Like, or that, like, they don't want to keep... Um, the, um, like, I'm like, oh, God, how am I going to say this? this is going to bug me so much. Um, to say, like, you know, like, I'm not worth it. Like, I am not, like, you know, a model or anything like that. You know, when I feel like a guy, like, they, like, at first when you talk to somebody, sometimes you get that initial, like, oh, you feel like you have the attraction and stuff like that. You think everything's going good, and all of a sudden, they drop off of the face of the earth from you and you try to talk and ask and they don't reply so that makes me feel like I must not meet their standards like more or less it's more the body than anything my mind is fine I mean whatever I accept whatever my mind you know I, I am a pretty smart person I'm not like a, you know and I don't act dumb in front of people I don't act like I'm like a you know like you know like, I don't know anything. I do show out that I do know stuff. Like, I do know random facts. I do know history. I know some stuff. You know, I'm not going to play like I'm a dumb blonde or something. I know it's a stereotypical thing. But, anyways. But, um, but yeah. I, I'm i still having issues with my body that I don't feel like I'm perfect. Well, I don't want to be perfect, but I don't feel like I meet the standards see that's how society is becoming is that all girls have to feel like oh being skinny or something like that is the big you know norm it's still it's still there even though they're trying to get other people like models different models they're you know in different weights and stuff like that but all general sense we're still in that society that is still pushing that you will look good in this outfit if you you know you know, if you're actually a size zero or size two or size one, you know, all those lower, like basically, let's say like under 10 is the good number to be. Basically, that's how I see it. Like if you're not in the double digits, it's to them, it's like, oh my God, you're overweight or something's going on with you. I don't like that. I still feel like they still need to make, you know, clothes that look good. Like, I still see, you know, mostly in magazines still. I mean, I don't, I mean, I haven't read a lot of magazines because I don't like to look at them. But, because I just feel like, you know, myself, I feel, you know. But, but now this is good that, you know, they still have those, those skinny models. You know, the models that still look good in those clothes, it has to be skinny. You don't see, I mean, I don't even see a comparison, like, of, like, the same outfit, but with one person being... You know, the, 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 the norm of women, you know, being the curves and all that stuff versus as the, like, you know, almost the skinny any models. I mean, you don't have those comparisons of the same clothes like that. You just have it, like, with one certain, like, even certain clothes are with certain ones. I haven't seen where, you know, the comparison, like, you know, it's like, oh, there's this, this outfit. It looks good with somebody that's, like, you know, under size 10. And also, right here is the same outfit, but it's with somebody that's above 10, basically. And, you know, that would be a nice change of pace. So, I mean, but, but all in all, guys, I, I do put on a persona, like, I'm a happy person all the time, and I'm, I'm fine, but all in reality, guys, I do feel my, my self-esteem is still low. I haven't found 
and I'm, and I'm still looking. I still haven't found that one person that's going to sit there and accept me as like what I am. I just feel like I'm being judged all the time and it's just, it hurts. It's kind of like almost my depression, but I'm not fully depressed. Like, you know, I'm not depressed. I mean, I, I still go do stuff. I still, you know, I go out in the, you know, you know, and I still wear some of the same clothes, but it's just still like, I sit there and critique myself like of what I look like in certain clothes I feel bad about it like I would love to wear skinny jeans but I feel bad wearing skinny jeans because I see my my basically my rolls are over the freaking thing and um but you know and I'm just like and I've tried different things I've tried going on diets like even healthier diets I've tried exercising but it's hard when it's just like it just I don't know but I've tried, but it's just like, I, and it, it took me about a freaking good of my 20s to realize, you know what, this is me, guys. And I'm going to tell you guys now, this is me. I am not plan on trying or anything like that. I'm still trying to tell myself, you know, you look good. Don't worry about what other people think. And don't, don't, you know, don't waste yourself on what you feel like. It, what you look like is the matter. Everybody's, you know, everybody's different. I, and I understand that. But I still, it's still a part of me that I still critique myself. So, and I'm grateful now that I have, I have like at least some friends that are truthful to me to tell me when I'm doing something like wrong about myself. Like, or they see that, oh, you haven't like freaking ate like for two days. What the heck is going on? And they, they make sure, I have a friend that makes sure I, I eat. I really do have a friend, and she knows who she is, but she makes sure I eat. I mean, she will even, like, when we're together, we'll have a snack together at some point. She says, I know you need to eat, or something like that, or she just, you know, she doesn't judge me as what I look like. She's like, you know, she says, you're beautiful in your own way. You know, we're all beautiful in our own way, and I want everybody else to think about that. You're all beautiful in your own way. I know it's hard in society, it's hard, you know, in life to have somebody critique you on what you look like, but you just realize you guys are all beautiful. You're all, you know, beautiful in your own way. So, I know this is like a very seldom, solemn, sad, half sad, half, you know, happy, <laughs> happy thing, but, but wearing this shirt today, it, it reminded me, you know what, I need to celebrate life and I need to hashtag believe in myself. So, and I love the message that Celebrate Life Production puts out there, and I'm so, so grateful to be, to be a friend of his and to do jukeboxing, which is his brother. I will put their links down below to go, so you guys can go check them out, but I do really appreciate you guys' friendship, and I do appreciate the message you both show. I mean, even jukebox, you do put something out there, and you know, and you always make my day jukebox. And you can act crazy, and I still laugh at you at all times. And 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 celebrate and life and celebrate life. You do the same thing for me, and I'm really grateful. And thank you guys for being there. And thank you for and then everybody else. Thank you for being my friend. So I better stop before I start really bawling. I'm a very emotional person right now, but but thank you guys for at least listening to what I gone through and stuff like that. I'm still trying to fight, but you know what? I've actually accepted myself. So I hope you all have a <laughs> great, you know, week, day, whatever, how, whatever this video comes out. So, so please like and share this video and please subscribe. And if you do subscribe, hit that bell down below to know when I post. I post at least once a week, maybe twice if I have something special to say. So, and also guys, just remember, you guys are all a book, and it's still being written. So, I'll see you guys all next time. Bye!